Do you love fast food? Fast food loves you more. <laughs> it's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Why did that feel so sensual? I like it. <laughs> we all know fast food. Simple pleasure for your mouth. Simple yep. punishment for your body. Yeah. <laughs> but no matter what kind of damage that ultimate triple stack double bacon Swiss lard burger does to your oh, waistline, so good. people still love it. Oh, I know. It yeah. tastes so good. Swiss it does. Lard the best I lard. know. <laughs> it's not surprising that the majority of all fast food sales comes from the drive through. Right. Mm. Yeah. Which is why the name of the game going forward is Speed. Whoa. I mean, how can it get any faster? Are they just going to throw the burger at you while you keep driving by? Like, you just don't stop at all? Well, As you're ordering, it shoots out of your mouth. Two years ago, the average McDonald's drive through took six minutes and 18 seconds. Okay. Oh, wow. And From, like, order to yeah. food. Right. Okay. Last year, they trimmed it down to five minutes and 49 seconds. Oh, my God. Alexis, wow. quick, do the math on that. How much time did they save? Three minutes? Minute. A minute. A minute 13, sorry. It's 29 seconds. Oh, that's it? Oh, okay. 29 seconds at. is the answer. I knew. I just didn't want to say it. Yeah. Ah. The goal is to get it even faster and maybe cut that time in half. Wow. Oh, my God. Why am I stressed yeah. out for every fast food worker? I like, I just have anxiety thinking about it. It scares me how they're making the food. Oh, fast? Are <laughs> they going to talk? I don't Ma'am, know. hurry. What do you want? I need to go. Okay, I got to put you on hold. I'm sorry. You got to keep moving. Well, it's like an auctioneer. When yeah. You pull up to the... How are they going to do that? Well, if you've been to a Mickey D's lately, you may have noticed they've upgraded their drive throughs to have digital menu boards with Ooh. pretty pictures of foods up on these fancy screens. And along with those screens, at least in certain cities, they've added an automated intelligence system. Oh, my God. It's going to predict your order. Is that what you're telling me? Well, so instead of pulling up and hearing like, <laughs> instead, yeah. you're going to be hearing this. Welcome to McDonald's. Whoa. My name is Scarlett. I hope your day is splendid. Now what do you fancy off of the menu? Please hurry. There are 43 cars behind you. <laughs> I don't like Scarlett. What? It's Whoa. like ordering from a saucy British Alexa. No, except yeah. Scarlett talks slow and then tells yeah. you to order fast. Yeah. <laughs> that's not really what is there. That's just oh. an example of what it might sound like. Oh. It's going to be an automated <laughs> system, with that, an Jeffrey. automated voice. <laughs> That's nice for the workers. Just mm. imagine, you pull up through the drive-thru, mm. you see the traditional menu board okay. up there, okay. and then once you order, the entire screen dissolves into a picture of a giant chicken sandwich. Oh. That's and, it, a nice and it just asks you, would you like to add this to your order for oh an my. extra $2? Wow. That, would work. that would work with me. It's I, like, I visualize it, I'm like, yeah. 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 <laughs> and the automated ordering systems will even consider the weather and the time of day when they're what? suggesting what you should get. Meaning if it's below a certain temperature outside, the automated voice might suggest a cup of chili instead of suggesting a side of ice cream. Oh, makes well, sense. It'll wow. never suggest ice cream because the machine's always broken. Yeah. 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 It'll, it'll never suggest that. But. Well, if you're just tuning in, we're talking about the changes that fast food chains are making to improve and speed up the drive through experience. Cool. And this is the one that's the coolest. To help cut down on order time, the restaurants are gonna start using license plate recognition. So as Whoa. soon as you pull up, they'll scan your license, and the digital screen is automatically going to bring up the last order you placed at that a drive through I don't dope. know if that would make me you feel like good. You like it? I, <laughs> I, I feel order. like it's order shaming me. Oh, yeah, like, me don't remind me what I did last time. Like, I want to come got... here and act like, oh, I only do this once yeah. a year. And it, look, it's not going to stop there either. Right now, at a burger drive through in Altadena, California, they've already started using facial recognition technology, oh, which lets customers pay without using cash or credit card oh, you just cool. you sign up via smartphone by taking a selfie and you put your credit card number in and then once you get in line the camera oh. takes your photo automatically pulls up your information and charges you so you never have that exchange oh i God. like that I yeah, feel so you, bad for the cool. Kardashians. Yeah. They're never going to be... Well, actually, they're never going to pay for anything. Well, because they're never going to recognize their faces because yeah. they keep changing. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, the thing is, what if your face pops up and it's like, too poor? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you don't have enough money in your I account. Bro, don't system. project like yeah. you're ever going to be too poor to, that is not your to get a fast food burger. <laughs> it used to be. Well, the facial recognition ago. technology, while it's pretty amazing, like we're finding out, is not very popular with the older generations. Oh, okay. Yeah, the 
the Apparently, yeah. there's a lot of concerns over privacy with oh, the older folks. Yeah. Well, and younger piece, generations it's... don't seem to care because they're already yeah. posting 40 selfies a day. Yeah, government's already tracking me. I have nothing I to hide. Yeah. I mean, for that piece is so silly, honestly. Yeah. It's like all the information. Oh, now you're trying to act young. I hate robots, but the information stuff, I mean, I'm sure that my credit card has been stolen three times since this segment started. <laughs> like I mentioned, this isn't far off future developments that's years away. This stuff is already happening, and they're quietly wow. testing these out at select locations throughout North America. And while it's been mostly successful, there have been a few problems. Oh. One is if there's kids in the car mm. or wind howling outside, it makes it hard for the AI to understand mm. what you're saying. See, I'm not oh. alone. Another big challenge is people who have unique ways of saying their food orders. Oh, uh, yeah, like say something wrong. Well, for example, like one customer said they tried ordering at an automated White Castle, and they said, quote, give me a couple castles with cheese on them. Yeah. Which is an order for two cheeseburgers. Right. Okay. But the AI was confused oh, because no. that's not the normal phrasing. So afterwards, they had to adjust the vocabulary on the entire machine. Oh, oh yeah, that's yeah. interesting. Because, you know, everyone speaks differently. Right. Yeah. So now you might be wondering, what about the future? of fast food drive throughs 10, 15, 20 years from now. Okay. One economist at MIT said, forget all human interaction. Because in a few years, you'll order through the AI digital screen, and instead of being handed food by an employee, an automated conveyor belt will drop <gasps> your meal directly through the sunroof. What? Through the sunroof. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, just just imagine it. Imagine this. Your burger will be dropping through your sunroof in exactly 4.3.2.1. Look out below. <laughs> Better be ready to catch that milkshake. Oh, it's everywhere. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know. I'm excited for it. Text yeah. in to 78592. What do you think about the future of automated drive-through technology? Your phone tap's coming up. Right.